Hello, my name is Shai Barashi and I am the Product Manager for ALM and Quality Center. In this video, we will cover the main reasons for you to upgrade to the latest ALM versions and how to achieve that. Let's start with why to upgrade. These are the top reasons to upgrade to the latest ALM versions. First is to take advantage of the new capabilities introduced in the latest versions, including the new client suffering and the strong analytics. Second is to enjoy the new integrations with the Agile ecosystem using MicroFocus Connect and the new plugins. Third is security with improvements such as SSO support and API keys. And the last reason is supportability with the end of committed support for the previous versions. In the client offering area, we remove the dependency on Microsoft Internet Explorer by providing three recommended options. The client launcher as a simple Windows desktop application that supports the entire functionality of ALM. The web runner as a lightweight web interface that supports most of the common functionality and can be run from any browser and any operating system. And the quality of things that can run on tablets for offline testing. In the visibility and analytics area, we introduce new graph types such as the composite graph that enables you to combine and correlate up to three graphs the plan versus actual graph that helps you track your test execution progress, the cycle time graph that shows how long defects remain in each phase, and the anomalies graph that shows how many defects remain in a specific phase for a specified duration. These new graph types help you to analyze your data and continuously improve. With the new quality insight component, you can manage KPI cards in the executive dashboard, to monitor the performance of the projects you are working on, and to search for records on one or multiple projects in the global search engine. The new My Homepage module highlights your open work items, most, re most recent updates, and favorite dashboard. By default, the My, Homepage, uh, the My Homepage module will be displayed after login to ALM. And the health report which is an out-of-the-box dashboard that includes a set of key metrics that help you track project status, and it can be used as a template for multiple projects. All these new capabilities help you unlock the value of your ALM to increase quality control. We also improve the integration with the Agile ecosystem. With MicroFocus Connect, you can easily integrate ALM with a variety of tools in your tools chain. Using the Enhanced Jenkins plugin, you can collect results from any automation tool and capture them in ALM. You can now share reports directly from ALM by mailing graphs from the analysis view. The new test management plugin for Jira helps Jira users to establish visibility into the quality process being managed in ALM without the need to log in to ALM. The new integration with Microsoft Teams helps you to collaborate with others over Teams chat. And if using ALM Mock 10, you can now inject your test results from ALM and share up to 15% of your ALM licenses. On the administrative side, we improve the security and user management, introducing a new support for single sign-on and API keys, which helps you to control the access to the ALM server from the API layer. We improve the license management with the integration with Autopilot licensing server, that helps you organize and manage your product licenses, server users, and client users. We productize the Site Admin REST API that helps administrators to automate the project maintenance tasks. We added support for public cloud providers that enables you to deploy ALM on any public cloud, such as Azure and AWS. You can now use the ALM robot for easier upgrade and the archive wizard for easier archiving of non-active projects. We also improved the audit log to support more actions such as change to workflow script. All this new security and administrative enhancement will ensure that you're ready for the enterprise. To summarize this part, let's first align on the support terminology. Committed support means really fully supported, including security and code fixes and hardware enablement. When the committed support ends, you can have extended support for technical guidance only. All versions below 15.0 are either out, out of committed support or will be so during next year. Our latest version is LM16, which was released last September and will be supported until September 2024. 
We do recommend to upgrade to the latest version to enjoy both the committed support and the benefits we have reviewed in the previous slides. Now that we covered the main reasons and motivation for you to upgrade, let's see what is the best way to achieve that. You can take advantage of the recent improvements to the upgrade process, such as the ALM robot, and do it yourself. You can get advice from our upgrade experts to plan the upgrade. If you like to get external help, you can engage with our professional services group or contact one of our certified partners to get help with your upgrade. The last option, if you would like to reduce your maintenance costs, is to move to our SaaS offering and get upgraded during the routine maintenance and administrative process. When looking into the upgrade path and how you can move from, from your current version to the latest one, you can see that we support a direct upgrade path from ALM 12.5 or higher to the latest one. If you are using an older version, you will need to make a stop on the way. For example, if you are using ALM 12.2, you can upgrade directly to ALM 15.5 and then to ALM 16. In order to prepare for the upgrade, we recommend to check out our online help center. Under the Getting Started, you can find information about new features of each version. You can also find a support matrix with information about the system requirements. Under the Admin Help, you can find the installation and upgrade guides. It is, also, it is also recommended to look at the best practice guide for upgrade tips. Under integrations, you can find the integration catalog to make sure all the, integration, the integrating products are compatible with the ALM version you are upgrading to. Thank you for watching this video. We hope you now have the motivation and information to move to our latest version.